Friends, a blessed day to you all. Welcome to our daily reflection from the Archdiocese of Port of Spain in the Caribbean. We invite you to join us now as we bring this transformative power of God's word into our own reality at this time. Come, Spirit of Truth. Come, Holy Spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke 12, 49 to 53. Jesus said to his disciples, I have come to bring fire to the earth, and how I wish it were blazing already. There is a baptism I must still receive, and how great is my distress till it is over. Do you suppose that I am here to bring peace on earth? No, I tell you, but rather division. For from now on a household of five will be divided, three against two and two against three. The father divided against the son, son against father, mother against daughter, daughter against mother, mother mother-in-law against daughter-in-law, daughter-in-law against mother-in-law. Woe to you! I have come to bring fire on this earth. And how I wish it were already kindled. Beloveds, what's our ambition when challenges occur? God is our loving Father, and when He takes the wheel, the division occurs. No longer will it be our direction, but his. And yes, he's answering our prayers. Hence the old must die for the rebirth. Oh, we oppose our testing and drop our crosses. But Jesus is the only example to follow, even if it means sacrificing family relationships until our other character is transformed and we become Christ-like. God's mission is why we were sent here. Living the gospel demands a choice. We must die to self, reject the pleasures and trappings of this world and what we think life should be. In facing fears, head on with utmost trust in God, we slip out from the devil's grip, fear and poverty of the mind. True freedom is rooted in total dependence on God, despite who stands or walks with us. His promises and blessings are visible to those who delight themselves in his word. Let us set this place ablaze. We bow our heads. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, It's now and ever shall be a world without end. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. May he come long upon you, remain with you, preserve you from that evil one, and grant you everlasting life. And the people of God say, Amen. Do have a blessed and pleasant day.